I gotta see this more closely now. It's changed so much just in the last few weeks. Let's, let's go take a look. So this is two weeks since I was out here last and we've seen a major expansion on the scale that we saw maybe of an entire growing season a couple of years ago. So this has just, just reached some critical threshold where the vegetation suddenly can, can establish itself. All this area to my left and behind me and over to my right is land that has developed in the last five or six years. This is basically the discharge point for Carnarvon water. It flows down this canal and a portion of that water flows into this, what was formerly a, a large pond called Big Mar. But that Big Mar pond has been filling up uh, over the last 20 years due to sediment from Carnarvon. And starting around 2004, that mud reached the surface and vegetation started to grow. And we saw the emergence of, of the delta. Well, Carnarvon was not designed or operated to build land, but the fact is, is that it does flow river water and, and that water inevitably has some sediment in it. Even in the last year uh, or two years, Carnarvon has not been operated much, but the mud platform that was built formerly is now being fully vegetated and we're seeing rapid expansion. So that now there's uh, probably approaching a thousand acres of wetlands now that are being developed in, in Big Mar Pond. You, you have the fresh water from the river uh, when, when Carnarvon is operated, you have the sediments, uh, you also have nutrients. Uh, basically the, the, the sediment builds a, a platform uh, the fresh water uh, triggers a, a diverse set of plant life that, that adapts to that type of developing ecosystem. The nutrients help stimulate the productivity. I mean, you have algae in the water, you have uh, you know, these floating plants, you have uh, rooted plants. Uh, all of that is using the nutrients uh, that are being provided. So this is the ideal recipe uh, for building a delta. This is the Bayou Bonjour. We're now in the middle, the heart of this new delta, the Carnarvon Delta. There's new land to my right, new land to my left. What you see is tall marsh grass with a willow forest. It's rapidly developing on this delta. This waterway in between is a small natural waterway. Of course, in Louisiana, we call those bayous. A few years ago, there was a book written by Mike Tidwell talking about the loss of coastal Louisiana, the name of the book was Bayou Farewell. Since this is a new bayou, you know, that, that land there and here was not here five years ago. This is a brand new waterway, it's a brand new bayou. My staff has recommended that we call this Bayou Bonjour. So, welcome to Bayou Bonjour. This is a brand new waterway. This is something we can now put on a map, a new feature on a map, rather than taking something off the map. And as long as the Canarvon Diversion is flowing, this waterway and others like it will develop, and this gives us hope in Louisiana that we can rebuild our coast.